What's up, YouTube? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, and share if anything in this reading resonates to you on your path, okay? So this is a channel message from Spirit of what's making you attractive at this time on your path, period. Okay, so we're just gonna get right into it. Pound number one is Celestite Group. Pound number two is the Angel Aura Group. Pound number three is the white calcite group mm. for some reason i strongly feel like this group here no nope, i'm not even gonna start channeling yet but i'm picking up some energy already and then we also have pound number four yes what is making you attractive okay so go ahead and pick which pal you feel most most drawn to all right if you feel drawn to two okay go ahead but go ahead and pick the one that you feel the most drawn to and that would be a reading and I will put it in the timestamps below, okay? So let's just get into it. What's up, pound number one? Welcome to your channel message from Spirit at this time on your path, okay? This is what's making you attractive. Go ahead and like, comment, and share if anything in this reading does resonate to you. Let's get into it. Pound number one, what's making you attractive? We have the throat chakra. Okay. So I really feel like it's your self-expression, okay? For some, a lot of you here, it's your throat, okay? Throat game crazy, no, I'm playing. But for some of you, um, it's just that you are somebody that has a strong presence. Your voice is very strong. I feel like for this group here, when you talk, people listen. Um, You definitely have words of value, and this is what makes you attractive. You're not just talking just to talk. Okay, for some of you here, you could have been silenced in the past, but you have found your voice. Yes, outdoor, you could have been outcasted here, mm -hmm. but you are still somebody here that is speaking up for yourself, speaking your truth, expressing yourself, sharing your message with the world. A lot of you here could be public speakers I'm picking up or teachers. You're definitely somebody that is of knowledge too, directing your communication, you're authentic, you're real. Real is the new, you know what I'm saying, the cool. Authenticity is the real thing now, you know what I'm saying? That's the new trend. Weird is the new trend. Being yourself, just be you, okay? Nobody cares. Are you definitely a divine feminine energy here? I do feel like you're still working, collaborating, or you're just talking about divine feminine energy. You could, you could speak to women I'm picking up. Taurus, Libra, Gemini, Sa ooh, we got Sagittarius. Some of you here may also be in like a woman's choir. Some of you could be singers, all right? But people find it attractive how you have broken free from things that were meant to hold you back or things that were meant to break you. You break free, you broke free, you know? People also find it attractive how you love to get outside in nature. You love to relieve stress. Okay, you love to just be outdoors. This person here, you're very connected to nature. Somebody here lives in Chicago or you've traveled to Chicago. Um, some of you here, a rose garden could be significant. People find it attractive how you like to try different things. You like to get outdoors. You like to explore. Mm hmm. I feel like this group here, you also are very connected to your angels. You receive a lot of communication. All right. We have the chariot here. All right. So your car, something about your car. Some of you here, you may also have some type of knee injury or knee pain. Not for everybody. Toothache, not for everybody. All right. This person is finding you attractive or this may be your name. I'm seeing Charlie, Charmaine. Charles, Roy, Aaron, Arrow. Hmm, okay. This could be your name. This could be their name. All right, I'm picking up some other names too. We're gonna keep going. We got the Page of Pentacles. People also find it attractive how you are somebody that is, you always deliver good news. When people talk to you, it's nothing but good news, okay? You're not trying to, you know, throw baggage on other people, okay? You may have a rose tattoo. You may have a connection to flowers, but I do see a rose tattoo significantly, for real. 
All right, people find your shoulders to be attractive. I am being drawn to her shoulders or their shoulders. Some of you may be drinking tea right now. Are you like to drink tea? All right. You're just somebody that delivers a lot of good news, okay? You may also like, look at her, her feet out on the grass. So you may like to put your feet out on the grass. You may like to go outdoors and get grounded, yeah. So this group here, you're very down to earth. People find this to be attractive. People wanna be your lover or people feel like you are in a loving connection, all right? People find this to be attractive. We got the Knight of Wands. Some of you here, you're, you're so free. People don't want to tame you. Like, people want to let you be this butterfly. Anita, Anaya, this could be your name. Robin, Benjamin, Ben. Somebody's last name is Scott. Claire. Some of you here are clairvoyant. People find this to be attractive. Ryan. Rianne, okay, yeah. Brent, Bree, Bree is out here for sure. Okay, we even got Bree right here, B-R-E. So Bree is here. Hello, pal number one, Brianna, Bree, or this person is finding you attractive. All right, people just find it attractive how you're moving towards success. People believe in you, you believe in yourself. Okay, you've overcome a lot of hostile people in your life. Okay, I am picking up some of you here could have been in volleyball. Wow. I'm seeing volleyball. I'm seeing tennis. Yes. What else? You have a highly competitive spirit here, okay? Or you work in a competitive field, but you're you are you're gonna succeed, okay? I feel like this person thrives in competition. Hmm. People still see you as a lover here. Queer and proud for some of you. So you're very proud in who you are. You love who you are. We got 56, 35, 53 could be significant. All right, May, June, September, and March. What's making them attractive spirit? Anything else? Outdoors. She be outside. Like I said, you don't want to be tamed. This group here. Brie. Yeah, I see Brie way too much, girl. Okay, Brie right here. We see Brie right here. Yeah. Yeah. Joseph, Joey. We have Brie, but spelled in a whole different way. B-R-E. Okay. B-R-E. B-R-E. B-R-I. L-O-L. B-R-E and B-R-I. So, yeah. I feel like for some of you here, you may have... Nope. Okay. Yeah, you may have broken, like, something with your knee. Had some type of knee fragment or something. I'm picking that up. Not for everybody, but that's very specific. Something with your knee. What's making them attractive here, spirit? Your perseverance. You are a warrior. Bree, Ari, Aubrey. You are loved, I'm hearing by spirit, okay? People find your passions to be attractive to pound number one. So yeah, let's move on to pound number two. If it resonated, leave a comment down below. Thank you. Next. Welcome, pal number two, to your reading. This is what's making you attractive on your... Is this pal number two? Yeah, this is pal number two. All right, I'll be for... Wow, so pal number two, when you come around, people will be like, is that who it is? That ain't who I think it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, what? She, he, they, they look so different. Wow, yeah, pal number two, you really make people, you know... What's that when they, when they look back again or take a little back, a step back? Yeah, a second glance. People have to take a second glance at you, pal number two. They're like, damn, is that really who I think it is? So, what's making pal number two attractive? We have patience. Mm, so, pal number two, you have a lot of patience. You're patient with people. 
You're also patient while you build. You just know that your patience will be rewarded. So people know this is attractive. Well, people find this is people find this attractive. I'm hearing Patty, Patrick, Patricia. Raven, Rachel, somebody may also like rap music. People find this to be attractive. Dreadlocks, braids, black hair. All right. They find this to be attractive. People find it attractive how you move away from things that are not serving you. Okay. Not in a selfish way, but in a way that you know your worth. You know, why would I sit in a room full of crackheads if I know I'm not a crackhead? Disengage. You know what I'm saying? I feel like you really know you your sense of discernment. You know, you're not about to do that. It's time to move on. A lot of you here, if you go out to a party or something, you're probably the driver because when you're ready to go, you're ready to go. All right, Jasper here. People also find out how grounded you are. Okay, you for some of you, you do remind people of like a bumblebee for some reason. So some of you may have a bumblebee tattoo or people call you honeybee, bumblebee, honey. All right. Feel. Feel is finding somebody to be attractive. Aspen. Gwendolyn. Somebody also has the last name of man. For some of you, you could be a man watching. Okay. But you're very attractive here. I'm feeling like this group here, you attract both. Yeah. Gender, sexes. All right. Oh. People find it attractive how you can get away with things, okay? Or people feel like you can get away with things because you're so attractive. Also, with the Ten of Wands here, you could be... Wow, look, detach. You know when to detach. I love this for you, pal number two. I f*** with you, pal number two. Yes. You're learning the art of detaching, learning the art of letting go. Or you have learned this. People find this to be attractive. You will disengage, Okay. Eight of Cups in reverse? Hmm. I feel like your past wanted you stuck. You know what I'm saying? They didn't want you to be able to move on. All right. Or people from your past, they wanted to hold you back. But you moved on. You're very attractive at this time. You're headed towards your passions. People find it attractive how you have something that you're passionate about. You have ambition. You have goals that you want to achieve. Okay. At least you not sitting around on your ass. You get what I'm saying? Like you have goals. Some people don't even have goals. You may not have achieved your goals yet, but you're working towards it. And people know that you will achieve it because you have a lot of passion, your diligence, and you just already have achieved so much in your life already here, pound number two. So, you know, you're very attractive here. Some of you may be painters, writers, models, beautiful eyes, beautiful nose, beautiful mouth. Yes, full lips, full cheeks, high cheekbones, okay? Some of you may also have bangs or maybe you used to have bangs people found found this to be attractive when you did ow or if you've been thinking about it you will look good you know scorpio out here you could be a scorpio we got virgo sun moon or rising aries little sag bumble so you may be on the dating website bumble oh so you may get a lot of people that are messaging you yes damn it could be bringing you burdens too, stressing you out, or people feel like you carry a lot. You got a lot to carry, but you're attractive while you're carrying it. You have a lot of responsibilities, but you look good while you're carrying it. You know what I'm saying? You may live in Cali. Your name could be Cali. Somebody may also know how to speak French. I'm picking up. Or you may know how to speak another language. This was making you attractive. Bilingual goddess, period, Pooh. Um... Anything else, spirit? Some of you may have a reptile or used to. You may like snakes, lizards. Not so I'm not going to resonate with everybody. But people find that to be attractive. Spiders, things like that. Yeah. What else is making them attractive, spirit, here? Ache. Some of you may be aching. I just heard Delta. All right. My patients were... Wow. My patience is being rewarded. My turn will come. Like I said, pound number two, you know your patience will be rewarded. Okay, this is what's making you attractive. Need I say more? Let's move on to pound number three. Okay, thank you so much, Spirit. 
Thank you so much, pound number three. Subscribe, like, comment if it resonated. All right, let's go. Hello, pal number three. Welcome to your channel message from Spirit of what's making you attractive at this time on your path. Okay, so this is general. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Apply it to where it applies, period. We have strategy. People find your strategy and how you move through life to be very attractive. Okay, you may move through silent or you may move with silence. You know what I'm saying? Small circle, tight circle. You're very strategic. Ooh, we have rates. Yeah, this person here, you are you have a high rate. You know what I'm saying? If somebody was to rate you, they'll rate you high. Okay, broke my scale. Throw back. You know what I'm saying? Be your mess. Broke my scale. Some of you here, you could be straight. Definitely. People find this to be attractive. Remember who you are. You are a perfect, loving child of God. So people find it attractive how you know who you are. You know that you are God's child, okay? Can't nobody take that from you. Mm-hmm. Can't nobody try to demonize you, pound number three. You know who the fuck you are, all right? You may live in the city. Some of you could be swimmers, or you may like to swim a lot. Um, people want to, like, match your vibe I'm picking up. People want to match you. Mm hmm Amber, I'm I'm hearing Amber. All right, Selena, Celestite, Selenite. Some of you may be wearing Selenite. We got the heartbreak here. Your name could be Selena, Alina, La Lonnie, Alana. Okay, Kalani, hey, Elena. All right, we got Izzy, Isabella. All right. Isaac, Isaiah could be significant. Israel, too. Okay. Somebody here drives a silver car. They find your car to be attractive. City. So I definitely feel like some of you could live in a city, too. People find your music to be attractive. People want to get your music like, yes. All right. People feel like you got the good vibes with the sun. Car here is always good vibes around you. Um, some people feel like you're not that generous but you're still a kind person you know what i'm saying um you may hold back from giving to people people may have taken advantage of you in the past so you may have some boundaries there okay but people find you to be an overall success story pretty much you will be a success story okay you're also somebody here that has grown a lot you're definitely somebody here worth celebrating and people find this to be attractive some of you here may be DJs. I did see people like your music. I'm hearing partying. Or you could be getting ready to go to a party. I'm seeing a DJ. DJ, DJ. On the ones and twos. Okay, we got the three of swords here. So I know this sounds crazy, but people find your... Uh, people find how you move on from heartbreaks. Or if you've had heartbreak, people find this to be attractive. But people find... How you have moved on and focused on creating happiness and peace in your life to be attractive. Some of you here, you could have been into drag. Maybe not so much anymore. Cosplay, maybe not so much anymore. But it, for some of you, that's what makes you happy. So Spirit wants you to get back into that. Um, I am seeing Sierra, Erica, Ira. Abby, Abigail, somebody has the last name Abel as well. Belle could be finding somebody attractive or Belle is something. It sounds like a cat name, Belle. Okay. What's making this pal here attractive? Pal number three. Nothing is impossible for the heart. Yeah, people feel like nothing is impossible for you. You're going to live out your heart's truest desires. And people feel like love always finds a way towards you. Like, you will never not have love, okay? You always have people around you that want to support you, that want to uplift you, that want to give to you. Even though sometimes you can be a little stingy, you know what I'm saying? And just, if this is you, Spirit is wanting you to give, okay? Practice healthy giving and receiving. It is okay to give, but give to those that are grateful, okay? That will be grateful, all right, some of you here could have been in cheer. They find this to be attractive. Gymnastics, dance, they find this to be attractive, okay? 
Again, there's some of y'all about to go to a celebration. I'm hearing dance again. Seeing dancing too. And Spirit just said dance. So, yeah. Some of you here may have a journal or notebook that you write in. People want to explore that. You know what I'm saying? They're very interested there. They find that to be something attractive. People find how you bring a lot of clarity towards people to be attractive. Your thought, your thought processes. You're very clear. 21, 32, 13 could be significant as well. 36, 63, 38, 83. 21. Abe, Abraham, this person could be finding you attractive. Yep. I don't compare myself to others. So you definitely don't compare yourself to anyone else. You know who you are, right? Remember who you are. It's like you are your you are your blueprint. Okay. Who who are you copying off of pal number three? Nobody. It says I was born to be original and one of a one of a kind, and that's exactly what the that's exactly what this group is. Okay, you're shining bright. Period. Okay, as you should. Okay, you know who you are. Chronic. Mm. Somebody here may have some type of chronic illness, or you may like to smoke chronic. You know what I'm saying? Something about chronic. You got that good chronic. Hmm. Well. I make a positive difference in the world. Exactly. You light people up, okay? You are just this big ball of joy here, pound number three. Big ball of positive energy. The vibes is right around you. Wonderful things are happening in your life. People see this, okay? Selena, Sabina. Sebastian. All right. My gratitude, yeah. People see that you're very grateful as well. People are thankful for your presence in their life here, pile number three. Never forget that. What's making them attractive here at this time, Spirit? When they're coming across this channel message from Spirit, we have healthy lifestyle. Yeah, you live a healthy lifestyle. You focus on things. This, yeah, this group here, you vibe pretty high, for real. Eat healthy diet, get adequate sleep, exercise regularly. You do all of that. People find that to be attractive. People also find it attractive, again, how you vibing high. Chakras clearing, okay? You got good chakras. You are in alignment here. Positive energy surrounds you. You don't surround yourself with negative groups anymore. Negative friend groups. Mm-mm. I'm hearing Akira. Somebody here, you may wear earrings. People find your earrings to be attractive. You're very overall healthy here. Pile number three. Raven, Rachel. Ralph, Ralph Lauren, Victor, Victoria. Okay. You're very victorious here. Sandra, Andrew, Andrea, Daphne. Take a resonance, leave a dozen. You have a story to tell. Pound number three. Yeah, and you bring a lot of peace and clarity to people. There's a state of nirvana around you, pound number three. All right. Take a resonance, leave a dozen. This person or you, if you heard their name, finding you to be attractive. I just heard a Ron as well. So, yeah. Take a resonance, leave a dozen. Have a blessed day, night, evening, whenever you come across this message. Let's move on to pound number four. What's up, pound number four? Welcome to your channel message of what's making you attractive at this time on your path. Go ahead and like, comment, subscribe if anything resonates in this reading, okay? Let's get into it. Pound number four, what's making you attractive? We have the Temple of Path. You would not believe your eyes if 10 million fireflies. I don't know why I just heard that wall. Lit up the wall as I fell asleep. Anyway. That's a channel song for somebody. But what's making you attractive is you're on your path here. Okay, somebody lives in Arizona. Okay, you're very polite. I'm picking up you are an empath, so this was making you attractive. People see that you treat your body as a temple. Okay, 12 could be significant. 
I'm also picking up, you are a powerful healer here, pile number four. So this is what's making you attractive at this time. All right, people feel nurtured by you. Your nurturing qualities and energy makes you attractive. All right, you may have a daughter or a son. The way you take care of your kids or the way you would take care of your kids or fur babies, people find this to be attractive. All right, Aubrey, Bree, Elise, okay, Grant, okay, Nikki, Simply love. Yeah, you're somebody here that just loves. People find your love to be attractive. You know how to love. You understand that love doesn't have to be hard. It doesn't. People make it hard. All right? People also find it attractive how you are open to new beginnings, open to take risk in life. Okay, you're able to trust. People find your ability to trust yourself to be attractive. Okay, Scorpio, Leo. All right, Four Swords. We got the King of Wands. Yes, Scorpio, Leo, energy as well. Aries, Leo, Sag, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini out here. All right. Yes. June could be significant to some of you. April. Yes. Matt, Malcolm, Malik, Malachi. Very attractive. Or this person is finding you attractive. Somebody has the last name of Hughes or Houston. Somebody could live in Texas here. Or you've traveled there. Houston, Austin. Don't matter what part of Texas. But we get in Texas here. Okay. People find your heart to be attractive. You're somebody here that eats healthy as well. I'm picking up. Or you try your best to. We have the uh, fool here. El Loco. Some people feel like you can be crazy. Crazy in a good way. Okay. La Muerta. Muerte. What? Muerte. So, I mean, a lot of you here, you could have lost some, a few things in your past. For some of you, you could have lost a lover. People find this to be attractive. So, maybe, yeah. Maybe you, yeah. People are showing you love. All right, with the four swords here, you definitely could have recently laid something to rest. For some of you here, you could be going on vacation here soon, or you are on vacation. Other trips that you take, people find it to be attractive. People want to go on a trip with you. You just be chilling, cooling, calm, and collected. People like that energy. All right, some of you here may be um, some kind of smoker. I do see a cig or a blunt or... Black and mouth, whatever this person is smoking, or a hookah. All right, some of you may drive a motorcycle. They find this to be attractive. Or people want to put you on the back of their motorcycle. You know what I'm saying? Marcus, Malik. Matt, Nathaniel. Daniel, all right, people find it attractive how you take time out for yourself. Mm -hmm. For some of you here, you've let go of everything and you just started completely over. You and your dog, you and your cat, you and your child, like you just are in this brand new energy. You want change. People find this as attractive how you want change. Okay, with the death here, you are ready to make changes. You've, you've had a rebirth. You are making changes constantly. Career changes, changes within yourself. People also find it attractive how you love nature. It says nature loves me. <laughs> Again, you getting out in nature, relieving stress. You love nature or people find you to be somebody that likes to connect. Okay, with nature. It's giving tree hugger. <laughs> Touching trees to get grounded, laying next to trees to get grounded. Somebody definitely lives in like Arizona, Nevada. There's like a desert back there, okay? Colorado, New York. Oh, okay. Anything else? Whoa, um. Sea salt. Somebody's using sea salt. Dead sea. 
But yeah, nothing is impossible for you here. People find that to be attractive. You have a big heart. Okay, you're going to always follow your heart here, pound number four. All right. You know when to rest. You know when to take time out for yourself. You're very intuitive. 36, 31, 23, 32, 62, 26. Could be significant. 16, 46, 64. Or this person that's finding you attractive is this age. I am being caught. Yeah, they're admiring your strength, your willpower at this time, and your tenacity. Wow. For some of you, you are a beautiful mother or you will make a good mother. The Empress. Okay, your beauty. Okay, it's very attractive here. You're drawing people in at this time here, pound number four, with your beauty, your fertility. Okay, you are embodying fertility, abundance, growth, prosperity. Like, you are the Empress. 33, 35, 53. Your mother is admiring you or you are a mother here. You will make a good mother. For some of you, you could be into beauty, cosmetology, esthetician. You could be an esthetician. You may do hair. You may do makeup. People find your artwork to be beautiful, okay? Attractive. Yep, the strength. Your your strength is definitely being admired here. You're taming things. People, people like your touch, too. If you've ever caressed somebody's face, they really miss your touch they like your touch yeah they're all in your head they're missing your touch somebody what's making pound number one attractive oh yes you went from the five of pentacles to the nine of pentacles you went from somebody that was in lack to very abundant okay you went from somebody that seemed to be down and out to somebody that now is a whole asset you know what i'm saying so people find this to be attractive. So take a resonate, sleep a dozen. Thank you very much, pound number four. Y'all stay blessed and not stressed. If you feel drawn to any other groups, feel free to watch those groups. Also, share. Thank you.